How to fix Crusader Kings 3 crashing on Steam? Go to the library and right click on your game, open up the properties window, and then under general tab and launch options box, try to type dash dx11, or you can also try dash d3d11 if the first command did not work properly, and then go to installed files and click on this button right here to verify the game files. And once this process is done, you can close out of this window, minimize Steam, and then open up your GPU application. So for NVIDIA, you will need NVIDIA app. Go to the drivers section from here, and then make sure to select game ready driver and download and install the latest driver. You can also hit this reinstall button to reinstall the latest one if you have it already. And if you have an integrated GPU, you can right click on the start button, go to device manager, and from here expand um, the display adapters and right click and click on update driver from here, and then search automatically. Next, you will need to open up your browser and then search for redist like this. Click on the first Microsoft link and then scroll down to the second table, which is this one. Make sure to download the 86 and the 64 version of these uh, redistributables and install them individually. And if you run the installer and you see that you have it installed, try to click on the repair button to repair your redistributables. And once you're done, you can close out of this. Next, you should try to disable any overlays that might be enabled. So for example, for the NVIDIA app, it has an overlay. Go to settings and then from here disable NVIDIA overlay by unchecking this box. You should do the same for Steam. Click on Steam on the top left, settings, and then in game. And make sure to disable Steam overlay while in game from here. You should also do the same on Discord. Click on the user settings and then scroll down to game overlay and disable it from here. Next, you will need to restart your computer so you can close Steam and restart your PC from the power button here. And once your computer is restarted, you will need to search for Steam before launching the game. Right click on Steam and then run it as administrator. And then you can simply launch the game and that should fix the crashing issues. Thanks for watching and subscribe.